at the end of the day you are going to be so thankful that you saw this video because I'm going to practically show you how to make scented candle using water. Yes, scented candle using water that could be used to keep your house smelling fresh all day without using air freshener. So, you need to watch this video to the end. Hello my wonderful people, once again you are welcome to my channel. From the intro, this is Pime Skills Empowerment TV, the subsidiary of Pime Skills Empowerment Academy, which is the best place to acquire any household cleaning production skills of your choice. So in today's video, I want to teach you a step-by-step -step process on how to make a scented candle with water without a candle wax and the good thing is that you definitely don't have to be worried about how to get the materials for this production because some of the materials you know you are going to be using are things you already have in your kitchen okay so before we continue i also want you to note that this diy is basically for personal use and not for commercial purpose because of the water that is involved it is basically for personal use because if you have to make it for commercial purpose it might not be convenient carrying on sealed water about so i want to use this medium to announce to you that my upcoming video is going to be on how to make a scented candle for commercial purpose and for personal use using a paraffin wax so let me know in the comment section if you are interested because the number of people that shows interest will determine if i'm going to do it or not and also if this is your first time on this channel you are highly welcome from the intro, I believe you can see what this channel is all about. On this channel, we upload valuable videos on how to make household cleaning products for personal use and for commercial purpose. So, I'll be so glad if you can take a second or two seconds of your time to subscribe to my channel and also click on the bell icon to get notifications whenever I post new content give this video a like so that it can get to other people i know together we can make it together we can do it and to my returning subscribers you guys are so so amazing i sincerely appreciate you all thank you for always watching my videos i'm not taking this for granted so stay tuned for today's training so let's get started the materials and equipment needed are your glasses or a glass depending on the quantity you want to make your glasses your colors some water I have my water over here you don't necessarily have to use distilled water since you are not producing any edible thing so you can use water from your tap so over here I have water followed by vegetable oil you can use any oil of your choice i'm using vegetable oil fragrance oil a pair of scissors to cut the materials a sharp object you can use something of this nature you can as well use your toothpicks if you do not have something like this, you can use your toothpicks. You need a piece of nylon, your candle wig, 
having known the requirement, the first thing to do is to place each of this glass on the nylon, on the piece of nylon, sorry. Now, cut the shape of, or cut the circumference of this glass. And the rest of the glass is on this piece of nylon. At the end of the cutting, you will have something like this. After that, the next thing is to locate the middle of this circle and pierce a hole with the sharp object. You can use your, as I said earlier, you can use your toothpicks or something of this nature. Make a hole in the middle of this nylon. After making the hole, cut the candle wig and insert it in that hole. So let me cut them one after the other and see you in a moment. After cutting the nylon and inserted the, the candle wig, this is what I've gotten so far. This is for this. This is for this glass. This is for this glass. And this is for the smaller glass. Okay. You can as well, you know, secure the back with anything. Probably your glue. But I'm not going to secure it. I'll just leave it that way. I'll leave it that way. I'll go ahead and look at if it is if it is too long I'll go ahead and trim the excess wig having done that the next thing to do is to start filling each of those glasses with water fill it to the middle point and leave a little space for the oil after the water the next thing is to start adding the colors into the water one after the other and after that top it up with the oil and then insert your candle wig wait for some minutes for the wig to absorb some reasonable amount of oil before you light them up and don't forget to add your fragrance oil into the oil before you know pouring it into the glass i'm doing i'm using this method because i'm using only one type of fragrance oil but in a situation whereby you are using different fragrance oil for instance this uh, four glasses four different fragrance oil you can use the fragrance oil after you have added the oil into the glass so since i'm not using different fragrance fragrance oil i'm going to add it into the oil mix it very well before adding it or putting it into the glass so carefully watch the video and follow every step
These are my scented candles. Over here I have color purple, I have color green over here, I have color pink and color blue. As it is now, the quantity of oil will determine how long it's going to last. So if you want it to last longer, you can reduce the quantity of water and increase the quantity of oil. So the quantity of oil determines how long it's going to last. Like the quantity of oil here can last up to 24 hours. Let's say 12 to 24 hours. And with this, we have come to the end of today's production of scented candle with water. How to make candle without candle wax. So go ahead and practice it at home and do let me know the outcome in the comment section. And thanks for being part of today's class. Stay blessed until I see you again in my next video, which is method number two, how to make a scented candle without candle wax. Scented candle with no wax method number two so stay tuned and bye for now